Hi, this is Ilma Art Studios uh, photograph for today, uh, fall scene in Orangeville. Check my website for more artworks and photographs at ilmaarts.com. Today I'd like to share with you my poem devotional extracted from Matthew 24, verse 35. It says, Heaven and earth will disappear, but my words will never disappear. And here's my poem. Word stays forever. All things in this world pass. Our bodies grow old and sag. Our circumstances change. Our points of view range. Heaven and earth will disappear. God's word will still be here. If you abide in it, it will. things will be clear. Nothing in this world will bring you fear. And here's my essay. The only thing constant in this world is change. All physical matters go through change and deteriorate eventually. The book of Ecclesiastes likened our life to a mist. It disappears like it. <coughs> Sorry. All the things we work for which we possess can end in an instant. Beauty is momentary. A person grows old and as he or she does, youth is gone and beauty fades away. All the things we cling to are sometimes gone before we know it. The Bible says that heaven and earth will pass away, but the word of God will never disappear. God identifies himself with his word. Scripture is eternal like him. He created the world and mankind using the word. He made everything by breathing word to bring it to life. Do we use the word to breathe with? Prayer. Lord, thank you for your word. Reflection. How often do you, do you use God's word to bring wisdom into your life? What has the word of God taught you lately? <clears throat> and um, I just like to give some insights as to that verse because I think um, <clears throat> that it the word has really totally changed my life because as soon as I started reading the Bible and um, being enlightened by it and applying it to my life, there was transformation, major transformation in my life. Um, it doesn't mean that there are no more ups and downs because there is always going to be ups and downs as long as we live in this world. But I know and I have peace in my heart that uh, circumstances change. But the Word of God is always there. It's stable. It's something that we can rely on. It's something that will um, help us go through a situation. It's something that will feed our soul. So the Word stays forever. As like in the beginning, God created the world by breathing the Word into it. And so it brought us life. And the same thing that it does in our life, if we breathe the Word of God in our life, then we're going to continue to have life and we will, be, we will have eternal life. Meaning that even if we die physically, we are still going to be with the Lord in heaven because that is His promise in His Word. And everything He says in His Word is true. It changes us. It teaches us. It tells us when we're doing right or from wrong. It tells us how to get out of a problem. And this is, and, and the world calls it problem solving, but I think it's God solving. Um, or the word, God uses the word to solve our problem. So thanks for watching, and I hope that you will get into the word every day because it will feed your soul, your spirit, and it will make you learn to apply wisdom in your life and have all the revelations that you need so that you will move on and bring God glory uh, by doing what the Word says and spreading the good news. Have a wonderful and a blessed day.